Hi YouTubers, I'm back and I'm here today to do a hygiene video because you want to make sure that you're smelling fresh and clean every single day and I'm sorry for the light in you guys because it's raining outside and so the natural light is just not working for me so I'm using my lamp today. But yes, you want to make sure that you're taking two to three showers every day, um, men and women, young women, older women, whatever. You just want to make sure that you're fresh and clean. Um, me, I'm probably a hygiene fanatic. I'm always trying new products, switching up my products and, you know, just talking about how to keep clean, how to keep cleaner or whatever. So I decided to do a hygiene video. Um, now, keep note that the products that I may show you guys that I'm showing you guys today are not what I may show in another video because I switch up a lot and I just ran out of some things today so I just will let you know what other products I use that I will not be able to show because I ran out of. Um, so if you guys want to see more of this video stay right there don't move and don't forget to rate and subscribe. Okay guys so let's get started. Um, so before I get started I want to say please 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 do not use soap on your body alone because that's not cleaning your skin i don't know what to call that i mean you're still dirty you want to make sure that you're using a scrub a towel a washcloth which is the same thing as a towel um a sponge something to get the dirt off of your body so if you're just using soap or body wash and just working that in with your hands that's just not it's not clean you might as well not even wash okay so me, this is what I use. I don't know what they call these. I think they call them a loofah, loofah, loafer, loofah. I don't know. But this is what I use. And you want to make sure that you update these every month. Like I try to get a new one every month. So this is what I use. And um, another thing is, is that I do not just use body wash. I'm not one of those people that can use um, body wash on my um, body alone I have to use a soap bar and so me I'm gonna show you guys the soap bar that I use um, now before I show you guys the soap bar please do not be mean and say oh why are you using that soap and it's not good everyone's different and me I grew up using this soap and I just can't get rid of it and I, I, I get it though some people may not be able to use this soap because maybe a little bit too strong or too much for certain areas of your body so if that's the case then don't use this soap at all um i use the irish spring soap okay i also use dove because dove is way more moisturizing than the soap but this is a soap that i grew up on i just cannot get enough of it i love it i mean my mom used to always have this soap in the house and so um every time i go and buy body stuff i have to grab irish spring so Irish spring it is and I take this and I apply this on my loofer loafer whatever you want to call it um let's just call it sponge for now and um I go in you know over my body with the Irish spring and I just want to say this down there I do not use any high perfume body washes shower gels none of that because you know it can be irritating at times and you just don't want to use anything that's too, you know, high in perfume or anything down there. So me, I used the Summer's Eve body wash, which I ran out of today, so I can't show you guys the bottle. But in another video, I will show you guys the exact one that I use. Um, and so after I use my Irish Spring, I then go in with a body wash. And I use two body washes because, I don't know, I just love body wash too. So the first one I'm going to show you guys is the... Suave, um, yes, the Suave Creamy Cocoa Butter and Shea Moisturizing Body Wash. And I used this one before this, I was using the Caress, which smells so great. If you guys don't like have Caress Body Wash, please go get it. But the reason why I started using the Suave is because it's a lot cheaper, they work really great, they smell really great, and so yeah, you know, I mean, you can't really go wrong. So the Suave Naturals body wash is what I'm using right now and this one smells so good this is a new one that I'm trying though because I was using the um the ocean breeze one so I decided to try this one out and so after I use that I then go in with another body wash and I use the April vanilla brown sugar and this is another new body wash that I'm trying out so this is another one 
and this one smells really good it smells like caramel it says vanilla brown sugar but it don't smell like vanilla it smells like some caramel yeah it smells like caramel candy to me but really sweet love the smell of it and sometimes i switch up so when i feel like switching up on my body washes but like i said always use a soap bar first me i always just use a soap bar first so when i feel like switching up and i don't feel like using the same type of body washes i'll use my bath and body works body washes and like i said these these body washes that i'm about to show you guys are very high like has a lot of perfume in them so i only use them on my upper body and my legs that's it um so this one is called sea island cotton which i showed in another video that i purchased on um black friday and i do have lots of other body washes but i'm just going to show you guys these two again because i use these a lot and this one is called sea island cotton and it has shea and vitamin e and it's a shower gel but like i said it's really high in perfume so um i would suggest using this in certain areas so i use this one and when i'm not using this one i'll use the moon life path one and that's pretty much all that i do um with that so i'm going to show you guys the next step which is um, the mouth how I brush my teeth and everything like that so okay so tuned. now we're gonna get to the mouth um, I'm gonna show you guys what toothbrush I use and I use this toothbrush um, it's, it's a reach toothbrush and it works really good um, I'm gonna show you how it looks and I like using this tooth um, I like using this toothbrush because it really gets in there and like get out all the food and so you want to make sure that you're really getting in the teeth and you know all over the mouth to get the food out and then the toothpaste that I use is the Crest baking soda whitening toothpaste and I like this toothpaste a lot because I like baking soda it really like makes your teeth like really really white and this toothpaste really helps with you know getting my teeth clean and um, you know making my breath smell fresher and so that's pretty much all that I use um, with brushing my teeth. Now for flossing, I use the Den these Dentec Comfort Clean Floss Picks. And I'm running kind of low on them, but this is just what I use to floss my teeth with. And I switch up, so sometimes I use this and sometimes I use... And then it has like a pick at the end down here. So you can get in there and get the food out. And then you can also use this on your tongue. And I'm running low, but like I said, I switch up on this a lot. So that's what I use to floss. And now for a mouthwash, I don't really use like Crest or, um, you know, those other type of mouthwashes that they use, like Listerine. I use, I like to use something that's a little bit more stronger because me, I cook with a lot, a lot of onion and garlic and I'm just keeping it real. This is just what it is. I cook with a lot of onion and garlic. And so for me, not that I have smelly, smelly breath. I mean, we all have smelly breath at times, but because I cook with a lot of onion and garlic, I need something that's a lot more stronger. So for me, I use hydrogen peroxide, and this is really good. And I just goggle my mouth with this and some water, and you want to make sure that you mix this with water because it's really strong, um, and it's really good for whitening the teeth as well. So um, it's like an antiseptic or something. So yeah, you want to make sure that you mix this with water. So I use hydrogen peroxide and that's pretty much all that I do for the mouth. Now we're going to get to what I use for moisturizing my okay, skin. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to show you guys is moisturizer, how I moisturize my skin. Um, me, I don't really use all these different lotions or anything like that. I used to use the cocoa butter, Vas the Vaseline cocoa butter lotion, which works really great. So if I had to recommend any lotion, I would recommend getting that lotion because it smells great and it works great. And I also grew up using that lotion in my house, but now I just don't use it anymore because I need something that's going to really like moisturize my skin that's going to set in. So I use the African Shea Butter and I showed this already in a hair video, but I have two, one for my hair and one for my skin and so this is what I use on my skin um, and I'm also a person that suffers from eczema so I have to keep my skin moisturized and I have to use something that's going to work and this works really well and you want to use it right when you get out the shower while your skin is still wet so that you can you know apply this it'll set in 
better and you only need a very little amount you don't really need too much of this because you don't want your skin too sticky or oily or anything like that so this is what I use on my skin and that's all that I use for moisturizing and while I'm at that I'm going to talk about what I do for under the arms I um use this well this was my winter let's just say this is my winter deodorant this is not what I use in the spring and summer because I use a gel under my arms for spring and summer and I used a secret one um so I'm just showing you guys what I was using for the winter um the teen spirit lady speed stick pink crush this is what I was using under the arms and no I don't use this now because you just can't go outside with white stuff under your arms and that's just not cute so no I don't use that now and that's all that I do for moisturizing and under the arms and I'm going to show you guys what I use um what fragrances i use and so, so now for, for fragrances that. i'm going to show you guys what fragrances i use and like i said i switch up a lot with these products so um i switch up a lot with my um, fragrances i don't wear the same thing every day and one of my favorite perfumes that i like to wear is the britney spears fantabulous perfume and this is like one of my favorite perfumes i use this a lot because it smells really good and oh my god it smells so good i'm not good at describing smells but it's it just smells really good and if you have this you know what i'm talking about and if you don't have it you need to go get it um and then another one of my favorites is the bath and body works moonlight pads um i had the body i showed you guys the body wash and i also use the fragrance mist because it just smells so good it smells like a um it smells like the bedtime lotion to me for some reason. If you guys don't know the bedtime Johnson & Johnson bedtime lotion, that's what this smells like to me. And I just can't get enough of that either. So those are the two body products that I use. And I do have other stuff, but I have a big collection. And I just show, show you guys the main thing that I use. But I do switch up with that too. So... I'm going to tell you guys what products that's missing here. The Summer's Eve body wash is what I use as well, but I ran out of today. And for shaving, I don't have any more of that either. I use the Nair to shave because I don't use razors and all that stuff. I can't really use that, and it's just too much work for me. I like to really do um, like a quick shave. So for me, I use the Nair, and I use the one that has... Um, what does it have in it? It has some type of something in it that's like good for the skin. I just, I, I don't remember. But I use the Nair and the Nair smells. So you want to make sure that when you use the Nair that you do it at night. I usually do it at night so that I don't have to go in and, you know, cause use body washes and like just go over and over. Because it has like a really, really strong smell and it's not a pleasant smelling smell or whatever. So... Um, yeah, I use Nair in the Summer's Eve, and for the face, I use the Neutrogena Grapefruit um, Acne Face Wash, so I will show those in another video. I'm going to do another hygiene video if you guys would like to see that. If you want to see a face routine video, just let me know down below, and if you guys enjoyed watching this hygiene video, please, please, please let me know um, down below um, what you guys thought of the video. Click like, um, subscribe, and I hope you guys enjoy, and stay tuned for some more videos. Bye.